In this lecture, you are going to learn about one of the example uses of friend function and that is to be friend of two different classes. Okay, so that you can operate on their data very easily and give some combined result. Okay, so that's something like uh, we have let's say one class Y okay, and one class X. Okay, the X coordinate stores your X class, you uh, stores your X coordinate value of a point in a two dimensional plane. Okay, so this class X stores the X coordinate, class Y stores the y coordinate okay and they provide some apis other apis also to change those attributes okay but our main concern is that okay we want one friend function that uses these two private attributes x and y to find the distance from the origin of that point okay because these two different classes they both have the so class x as attribute x coordinate class y has co attribute y coordinate and we want a class uh, friend function that will give us the distance from the origin okay so private uh, class x is defined which has private attribute int x then we have a constructor which takes x coordinate as argument okay and we define a friend double okay a distance which tells us the distance okay from the origin okay so it has it's a friend function defined by a keyword friend it returns a double and its function name is distance dist it takes two arguments one of type x object and one of type y class okay so class y again a private int y coordinate you have a constructor and the same friend function double which returns a double and whose name is distance and it takes argument x and y objects okay so now something more important let's see the definition of this distance so it takes two arguments x d1 and y d2 these are the two numbers okay returns square root of d1 dot x whole square into plus d2 dot y whole square okay so we do the just use the pythagoras theorem here and find the distance from the origin so very simple so now we have x a3 one object of class x we have a in that the x coordinate is 3 for y class which defines the y coordinate it's 4 we see out we do distance we pass the a and b objects okay instance and then we see that you will get the distance okay so let's try to see this code so we first build this one builds fine and then see the distance is 5 okay so which shows that basically this class used the attributes and then we got the answer okay so the major takeaway was when you have to use two different classes okay so when we have to use two different classes and we need to find some interesting result which uses the private attributes of those both the classes we need to define a friend function okay which is a friend to both the first class and the second class if in fact you can extend it to three classes for example you had x y and z coordinate for a point okay so in three dimensions i hope you understand this thanks a lot